Welcome to FFT. We are here in our new show area at our headquarter in Fulda. My name is Marco Bitsiak. I'm the head of the Competence Center Digital Factory. And I have the pleasure to explain to you our new project that we have with one of our customers and partners, Alstom. Normally we're dealing for the automotive industry and in the automotive industry we have around about 5,000 well spots on the car body. Randomly 100 to 200 robots doing these well spots. Makes 10 to 20 well spots per robot. Regularly we will do a simulation and then we do a reteaching on the body itself. Let's talk a little bit about the challenges of this project for the railway industry. We have the fact that within this wagon we have around about 25,000 well spots and just 10 robots doing these well spots. Makes 2,500 well spots per robot. This is a complete different story now and we have to find a solution for that to achieve the target. We suggested Alstom to use a company, Realtime Robotics, a Boston located company that supplies a very cool innovative product which offers you the support of calculating the complete path inside your simulation cell. It's basically like a currency. You have all your machine structure inside the cell and you assign the targets to the system and the robot. So the complete calculation according to your targets and what bearings you are applying is done automatically. You just give the rules, the distances, the, the structures, and everything is calculated automatically. What's really cool and nice is that it's not just a tool which generates you a path which you need to load to the robot. The system is also capable of handling the complete running of the robots. It's connected to the robot controllers. There's actually no real robot program for the path inside the robot controller. And the real-time robotic systems is completely controlling every movement of the robot. By doing that, because the system in the background knows really the complete structure of the line and the position of each robot, it's denying a collision in between robots. So the main job, which is a real task, is making sure that the robots are not colliding or hitting each other is completely prevented by the system. This is what we think is a very modern automation structure and the automation solution. And that's basically what we're after. Let's sum up the benefits of the system and the integration of our standard. The complete automatic creation of the robot parts is one issue. Second is you don't need to export the parts to the robots. They are online in the robots. They're controlled by the control system on the fly. So there's no need. The PLC can be very lean. You don't have to care about robot programs and robot functions and zone locks and interlocks to robots. Your only communication is with the robot, uh, rapid plan control system. And the next thing is adaptions and changes are very easily on the fly. You do them offline, you check them offline, you load them up to the control system and they're in your machine. 